What's up guys, it's Angel here and today I have finally reached a 40 radar chain for my Jigglypuff. This will be for my fairy entry. I could have chained for a Noctowl, a Gothit Rita, yeah and I think that's all from this route that I don't have. But I thought Jigglypuff would be a nice fairy and pretty easy in this grass. This is one of the easiest grass locations to chain. But as always, the camera angles in Pokemon X and Y are unbelievable. I'm almost confident enough in my skills to actually make a tutorial on how to chain. But it's basically teaching you how to be patient because these chains do not take like a short time. They take forever. And... This is quite a long, you know, reset to get a shiny. I don't know how many encounters it took me afterwards, but I will see you again when we find the shiny. There'll be a link to click if you want to skip this bit. Otherwise, enjoy the Jigglypuff music, and I'll see you in a second. Oh my god, there's a shiny patch! Alright, let's finally claim our shiny. Woo! There it is, my shiny Jigglypuff. And this took me pretty fast compared to my other chains as they keep breaking, but this one didn't take me as long, so I'm pretty happy it wasn't that bad, but look at the green eyes, green eye hype. I mean, I would be more excited, but it's a Jigglypuff and I kind of already had one and a Wigglytuff, so it's like, woo, and it sort of loses its type, but it is a shiny nonetheless, so we will enjoy it. I'm going to catch it in a nest ball because the green rings, it actually kind of looks <laughs> worse than it does on the picture that it shows, it looks like it's got more green, but there it is, we've caught our Jigglypuff. Gonna name this Jigglypuff, but we will check its stats. Nature, whatever else there is. Alright, we'll just save here. It's always important to save after a shiny. <laughs> you don't know what happens to your game. Alright, so we're just coming into our um, summary here. Competitive, it's got its hidden ability, and it's a modest nature. I don't know if that's good or not, but competitive as an ability is pretty good. Now we'll just find this Jigglypuff again and we'll do a comparison to the original. So shiny to original comparison is always the best way to do chain Pokemon, in my opinion anyway. Because you can see the difference, although the green eyes are pretty obvious. Thank you for watching, good luck with your shiny hunts, and I'll see you in the next video.